So, so now you now you're a coach. Uh, how much, how much are you this uh, stage founding a way of playing? Or what's your philosophy? Uh, remember, you come now. You're in Scandinavia, or in Norway. We we have to publish books to change the system. So, what kind of managers? What kind of manager do you wear this time? Because you had also a big success with West Ham United. A bit. You no, know, I was brought up, you know, with Ron Greenwood. The only way I knew, and the only way that inch, I wanted to play football. I wanted a team that passed and played. I would play from the back and, and play through the midfield and would play football. And I signed players. I loved players that with ability. I loved I, the players, the kids that came through, all that great ability, all those kids I talk about. I said to Rio Ferdinand, when he, you know, at 15, I said, I don't ever, don't ever let me see you just booting the ball up in the stand. I want you to, you play. You might make a mistake sometimes, so what? Beckenbauer made a mistake. Bobby Moore made a mistake. You're going to make your mistake. But don't be afraid to play. Take, play, take risks. Play, play, play through midfield. Play, play, be, you know, don't just get it and kick it up the field and want to get rid of the ball all the time. Play from the back. Be confident. If you make a mistake, I'm not going to come in and start shouting and screaming at you. It's my fault. I take the responsibility. And Rio, that's how he played. And so I wanted a team that played football, and that was what I produced. When you had your team meeting before, before the game, would you then put up a formation or would you just put up your starting 11? Um, no, we knew the formation, how we played. I mean, you know, we'd, all week we would know it was... It got more and more difficult, you know, we... You, you're dealing, as, as it goes on, yeah, and you're dealing with people, you start picking a team on a Monday, you've got four days of aggravation with five or six players who are not going to play on Saturday. You've been there. They are, they are, believe it, I don't care what anybody says, you're always going to have the problem. So the later in the week as a coach, as a manager, if you can maybe Thursday, you think, okay, we'll work on the team on Thursday, I know he's going to be fit, I've only got aggravation Thursday and Friday from the other six or seven who ain't playing, and, and that was a little bit how it got, it was a, it's half of it is psychology. One of the best managers I ever, you know, was a guy called Danny Williams, and Danny, on a Friday, he would go in, and when the team went out to train, while he was out, he used to put the team up on the notice board and then he'd get in his car and he, he lived about <laughs> 50 minutes, an hour away in Sheffield, he was the manager of Barnsley. He'd drive home, by the time the players come in and saw the team, where's the manager? He was back home having a cup of tea. <laughs>